Eivor, a welcome vision for my eye. Thanks to you, Ardmel joined our trade. Their sweet honey will lure our most demanding merchants. Is honey so valuable? It is liquid gold, but luscious and sticky. Care to indulge in profitable commerce? Enough for today. I look forward to your return. What has happened? They have summoned Flan. I hope he shows soon, if only to end this bickering. Speak. Lord, there has been much deliberation these last few days. News of Owen has spread like a mountain fire. The people are frightened. We are unsettled, to say the least. A trusted abbot unveiled as a pagan conspirator. The druids have permeated the church at the highest level. There's no telling how far down it goes. Something must be done. We must rid them of this land. Begin an inquisition. How dare you speak like this? Owen acted alone. He belonged to a sect. There are others like him. Do you deny it? I do not deny it. But then you will speak only of the children of Danu. A weed that grew from druid roots. If we allow it to thrive, how can we ever be certain this will not happen again? Flam, I do not like what these men are implying. Do not entertain this. You would presume to tell your king what to do. You, who share those druid roots. You even know this sect by name. Perhaps, like Owen, there is more to you than meets the eye. Bastard! Enough! Speak to her like that again, and rats will sup on you. Alive. Apologies, my king. Poetess. I do not mean to cast suspicion. Only to draw a very real comparison. We do not know from where the next threat will come. And we cannot simply hope that it will not come. We must put aside our differences and come together as Christians if we wish to preserve an Ireland under God. Flan, if you do this... I know well where you stand, Kira. Are there any others who wish to speak? I will. This gathering shows us something very clear. That there is solidarity in this cause. If we do nothing, the weeds will continue to sprout, leading to unrest across the kingdoms. But if we act, begin an inquisition. It will lead to unity this land has sorely lacked. These are my people, Siegfried! And there are those within who threaten the very fabric of this land. Can you really stand there and defend them? Anyone else? What is being proposed is a bold strategy, the consequences of which cannot be properly weighed just now. We must allow time to reflect, Lord. Every moment we waste weakens our position. Lord, we kings are all in agreement. There is but one move to make. We will launch an Inquisition. Every druid will face a choice. Reform or <sighs> exile. The future of Ireland is a holy Christian one.
Where did Kira go? Set off for her house, just down that road. Looked mighty upset. Kira's not of sound mind. I need to settle her down. Kira! Get out! Leave me be! What is this? What are you doing? Flan, spineless fool. What was he thinking? He saw an opportunity to unite the kingdoms. He seized it. It is what any king would do. Do not defend him! I am not. But consider what would happen if he ignored these allied kings. You're right to be upset. But you know Flan best. This was not a decision he made lightly. Let us go back and talk with him. If anyone can convince him to reconsider, it's you. Oh, I will. Whether he wants to or not. What? I am sorry, Eivor. I cannot let them erase us. <laughs> Can you hear me? Eivor! Are you alright? Did you see Kira? I expected her here. Eivor? Oh. What is that? I think it's Kira. It must be. I do not know what she's trying to do, but she's angry. This is my fault. I must speak with her. It may be too late for that. She said she would not let you erase the druids. But what means would she use? The Lea Fall. I think she'll try to use it to stop you. A stone? It's an ancient part of her lineage. There may be more to it than myths and legends. I knew my decision would upset her. But I was certain she could find a way to understanding. It was no simple decision. By choosing one, you betray the other. Choices that weigh heavily require ample time to reflect, if you are to find the best outcome. I acted rashly. I listened to frightened men, Eivor. Men whose loyalty I hungered for. Clear your head, Lord. We're nearly there. Where is she? Our dear. 
Your sword, Flon. Stay close to me. Eivor, what do we do? Fight! These are my men! It's them or you! Now fight! They will not listen. Kira's taken the reason somehow. Defend yourself! I do! This is too far! This is your hero! There could be peace between us! Just another lie! Christ's blood! <laughs> By all that is holy! Keep your guard up. Kira! Where are you? Kira! Flan? Ah! How to raise the stakes? How about the king's blood on your hands? Eivor! It's enough, Kira. Surrender now. Nothing but a ruthless raider, hollow inside. You speak of honor. Where is yours? You know. With God, his son, another pawn in this endless war. He has my blood. Ah, yes. And you will throw away all reason to defend what you are sworn to. I am no different. My people will live to see tomorrow, if it means I have to kill you today. Many victories. Do not make me add another. Do as you must. As will I. Before it's too late, I will die for it. Let them trample us. I told you I would never see the Druids into darkness. Why pretend to be my ally? I pretended nothing. I thought, I hoped you could be better, better than Owen. Don't compare me to that demon. No. Look around you. You set in motion what the children of Dawnu hoped you could. You became the vessel for their plot. I always have been. After Mother died, I became the last. The last who could awaken the Leofal. Never did I think I would use this gift so foolishly. What now? It ends. Owen, the children of Thanu, they only exist in pursuit of the stone's power, and I am the key to unleashing it. You must kill me. Kill me, Eivor. If I die, Tara's power dies with me, and there will be nothing left to lead my people astray. The old ways will return. Let me do this. Let me save them. Please. You may be the key to this power, but the stone is the source. This 
destroy it. You know I cannot. Your ancestors are souls in another realm. They will not despair of this stone's loss. Sometimes we must sacrifice what we treasure most to protect the ones we love. Bury the past. Build the future. Kira, I bow my head in contrition. I fail you. I failed you and the true druids of Ireland. For that, I truly apologize. I will speak to the kings and undo my rash decision. The land you have wished for is secure. I hope it is so, Flom. Farewell. Farewell, Eivor. Where will you go? How are you feeling? Bruised. Battered. But I'll live. Though it'll take some time to reclaim my pride. Took a lot not to kill you. If you wanted to, that was your chance. <laughs> I suppose at the end of all this, it's safe to call you a friend. See to it that Sigfrid's reign is long, and you shall never know me as your enemy. Have you met with the other kings? I take it that is why you have come. I have. The Inquisition is buried. High King is a leader to all who share in his land. You helped me see that. My only regret is not having understood it sooner. You worked to secure a future for all. Hero would be pleased with this outcome. I know there is much that awaits you in England, Eivor. You can set your boots in Ireland any time you please. Farewell, Flan. Until we meet again. What do you think my father would make of all this? Barith wanted to ensure the Dublin he left you could stand upright on its own two legs. And while he could not see it through, he would be proud you did. I will never forget what you did for my family. Our family, Sigfrith. Keep well, and may your father's hooger be with you always. It shall with me. My business partner. Many kingdoms desire to trade for our goods. Perhaps that's enough. Another time.
Why hello, Eivor? Azar. We are good friends now. Ah, let me guess. You wonder how I lost my eye. Such a loss is a badge of honor among the Norse. Not for me. I told you of my partner, Constantinos. Betrayal was not enough for him. In his fury to take all I had, his men beat me, left me for dead. They slew my family. I survived, but not in one piece. I'm sorry. I did not mean to bring up a painful past. You are my friend. It is best you know. I always enjoy the dance of trade. Enough for today? Always a pleasure. Tis done. Here are your blood-soaked bits of amber. I felt them die, each by each. Boil these shards. Make your potion. I shall, I shall. I've been preparing for this since we met. You spoke of great power. The spear. You'll have it in your hands soon enough. Once you defeat Balor. You said nothing of this? Surely you remember Balor. He is heat, drought, a scorching sun come to Earth. I know of no such creature. Many heroes fell to him, but Woden would not. The lance called Gaebolug pierces his flesh. This is where he is weak. Are you ready to fight him? Let me drink. Drink deeply. You'll remember. Balar is ancient. He is <laughs> chaos itself. Defeat him, and the spear is yours. <laughs> I have come for your power.
must speak to Deirdre. I felt you would prevail. It was an unusual contest. The spear, Gay Bullock, is yours for crushing the children of Danu and defeating Balor. Despite all that's happened, Kira will find solace that the Danu have been extinguished. Small comfort, I suspect. I thank you for sparing her. Someday she may return to us here in the forest. Her spirit will be welcome. Goodbye, Deirdre. Slan, Eivor. Slan. My business partner. Illuminated Gospels have arrived from Listero, thanks to the new trade post you claimed. I'm impressed. You doubted me? I meant the manuscripts. The crafting is magnificent. New contracts, new riches. Always a pleasure. Sorry, I did not notice you. Azar, is everything all right? Yes. No, it will be, once that bastard is dead and hanging from my rafters as sausages. I believe I know who this is about. Constantinos has come to Ireland. Yesternight, his ship pulled into the bay. I will deliver you his head. Your offer is appreciated, Eivor, but not necessary. He threatens our trade, does he not? I protect my greater interest and provide my partner a service. Very well. But do not deprive me of my revenge. Bring him back to me alive. I always enjoy the dance of trade. We'll close the books on that. I look forward to your return. Shit, I love you. I'd hope to finish you this time. You were always careless. At least I took your eye. And your brother, the sniveling sop. 
along with your loud bitch of a screaming mother. Come on, have at it. Let's end this quickly. Quickly? Oh no, 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 my dear Constantinos. This will last a very long time indeed. Why else have I sharpened so many implements? I will unmake you tenfold for what you've done. You make a sorry Cyclops. Damn you to hell! Why, hello, Eivor. Azar, what of Constantinos? Hogs feed on his bits. Are you at peace? At peace? No. But the world is a better place. Another time. <laughs>